Well, here's the starting lineup for Ajax. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4 2 3 1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4 5 1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. This particular setup is becoming more and more in favour. Yes, Derek, one central striker, two wingers will provide the width, a very narrow three in midfield. A back four, the two full backs will be expected to support, but also defend and help out the centre backs. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Wonderfully weighted pass. Look at the fans, they're going absolutely crazy. Well, I do just love goals like this. On the breakaway, they soak up the pressure. You have to be organised when you haven't got the ball to break into the positions when you get the ball and hit the team on the counter-attack. And it's a clinical finish at the end of it as well. Masrawi here. Good-looking sequence. And he's beaten him here. Targets to aim at. Firing it towards goal. And it's gone in! The team's separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Well, what a time to score. The forwards are in absolute dreamland. The defenders slugging their way back to the half-time team tour. They're not going to enjoy this. And space for the cross. Has a go. Oh, it's in. Well, not quite according to the script, but as things stand, they will still take the title. Well, it's just a little warning, Derek, isn't it? They've taken the foot off the pedal the last five minutes or so. Need to press a little higher for me. Surely they can't throw this away now, though. Well, here's a replay. I never liked rebound goals off goalkeepers. The defenders should be there. Probably... Van der Beek. Really sitting deep. Oh, my goodness! What's an outrageous hit! I can't believe he took it on from there, and neither can the goalkeeper. Let's have a look at this replay. Caught the keeper on his heels, and this is why. Short back lift, great strike, takes everybody by surprise. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. And the referee has blown for full time. It's official now. The champions have been crowned. Absolutely top of the pile. That's all you can do when you start off pre-season. You see this moment in your mind's eye. They've got their brilliant season. It really has been. The goal to be the best team in the league. And they've hit the target. Well, Derek, there'll be definitely times this season where the form has dropped. We've had injuries, etc. Almost seems like a pipe dream. So look at these moments now. Well, they'll celebrate long into the night, I'm sure. Well, memories, memories for players in these situations, Lee. Well, it's always nice to win any trophy, cup competitions. But when you win your own domestic league, that, to me, is the pinnacle of being a player. Yeah, the table does not lie. And so, the league champions. Yeah, brilliant. They deserve it. They really have been the best team this season. And that's where you end up, top of the pile. And not by accident either. All part of the master plan. And the trophy is theirs. Well, this is the best moment for me, sharing things with the fans. They've deserved everything they've got this season. The players have, but certainly the supporters. They've given the players absolutely 100% support all season. And this is their reward. Really a 
match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And this is always part of the fun, Lee. The photographs. Absolutely. One for the scrapbook. Not so sure players have scrapbooks these days, but I've still got mine in the loft somewhere. So there we have it. The league champions.